I have just built this complete Flutter mobile application inside Klein. Klein is a completely free and open source AI code editor and I'm using Kimi K2 to write code for me. If you don't know about Kimi K2, so Kimi K2 is probably one of the best and cheapest AI model out there to write code. And in fact, if you see Kimi K2 is giving tough competition to Clouds 4 Opus in agentic and competitive coding. The most exciting thing is in this video, I'll show you that how you can use Kimi K2 absolutely for free without paying even a single penny. But first, let me just show you that what I have built using Kimi K2 and Klein. So basically this is a traditional car hire application and I just gave a very simple prompt which was I want to develop a car booking application inside Flutter and that was it. I did not provide any other specific details. I just like provide this basic detail. So Klein agent is so good that it just got this command and then built this amazing mobile application for me. So you can see there is this search bar which is fully functional. If I just like search for a BMW so you can see it has this BMW X5 which is available to rent. So let's suppose if I just like go ahead with this car, I can simply just click on this book now button. After that, it will show me this screen, which is the feature screen. And in here I can see this is a petrol car and it has five seats. It is automatic. The price per day is $120. From here, I can simply just click on this book, this car. And now you can see this is the complete booking form. And from here, I can just like choose a start date, which is today's date and then end date, which may be a 22nd. I can just like choose that. And then you can see inside this price summary, you can see it has automatically calculated the complete cost and that has shown here $360. And then I can just like give my details. I can just like give any sort of my email address. And after that, I can simply just provide the phone number. And once I have provided all of these details, I can simply just click on this confirm booking. And now you can see the booking is confirmed. And now I can just like go back to home. And now even inside this booking tab, I can see all of my previous bookings. So you can see this was the first booking that I made. This was a pending booking. And then this is the recent booking that I just made. And it has all of these order details. And all of this was built inside client using Kimi K2. And it was just one single prompt. So the main purpose of this video is to test the capabilities of Kimi K2 because right now one of the best AI model out there to write code is Claude Sonnet 4 and Claude 4 Opus as well but Kimi K2 is giving like really tough competition to Claude 4 and on top of everything this is like 10 times cheaper model than Claude 4. So maybe if you're paying $200 for Claude code maybe you should reconsider and that's the whole point of this video that Kimi K2 with Klein or something like Rue code can be a deadly combination and maybe you can get like similar kind of results that you can expect from Cloud4. So before you start, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and click on that like button as well. And if you're not following me on X, please just go ahead and follow me on X. All right, the first step is using Klein. So if you're not aware, if you have not used Klein before, so just go to Klein.bot, this website, and then you can just start using Klein absolutely for free. Simply just click on this install Klein and then it will just open this pop-up. And if you're using VS Code or Cursor or Windsurf, you can install Klein for all of these AI code editors separately. Or you can just go inside VS Code and then go to this extensions tab. From here, you can just like look for Klein, C-L-I-N-E, and you can then find Klein in here. And then you can simply just click on this and then click on install and then Klein will be installed. Once you have completed this step, the next step is to get an API key to use Kimi with Klein or Roo code. So to get an API key for Kimi, you can just like go to open router. Open router is a platform where you can access all of these different AI models. You can just like in here in the search bar, you can just look for Kimi. And in here you can see there are different variants of Kimi. The first one is Kimi K2 free. You can just access this one as well. You can face rate limiting. But if you want to like use Kimi on a like regularly as your main LLM to write code, so I highly, highly recommend you using the paid version of Kimi. You can totally use the free version of Kimi, but of course you'll face rate limiting. So now the next step is creating an API key to provide it to client to start using this Kimi model. So you can just like go to your profile and then from here, simply just go to this key section. From here, you can just like create an API key and let's just give a name to this API key. Then simply just click on create and then it will provide you an API key. So just copy that API key from here, go back to your client. And after that, you can simply just go to this settings tab from here. And after that, in this API provider section, you can just like choose open router and inside open router, you can just like then choose any of these models from here. So in here, you can write Kimi and you can see this is the Kimi K2 and then this is Kimi K2 free as well. You can use either Kimi K2 free or you can just like use Kimi K2. If you want to like use Kimi K2, make sure that you have added some sort of like credits inside open router. So you can just like go to this credits tab and from here, then you can just like click on this add credits button and then you can just like add credits. Otherwise, you can just like use the free version of Kimi, uh, this Kimi K2. So I'm just going to use the Kimi K2 because I have my credits in there. So I don't need to like use the free version. 
So once I have done that, after that, you can simply now in inside client, you can just like give it a prompt. So right now you can see inside client that one prompt that I provided it, which was you are inside Flutter project, create a car booking app with mock data. So in here you can see this prompt cost me $0.3 and then for $0.3, it developed this complete kind of like MVP for me in just like literally five to six minutes. And then you can see it created all of these different screens. This is the home screen dot dart file because we are inside flutter so we are writing this code in dart and this code was 300 lines long and then next one was booking screen then there was main dot dart screen then there is booking confirmation screen so it created all of the components which are required for this app to be functional and which is like completely flawless in this like first attempt it created like a proper fully functional app with just like basic prompt. So if you're someone who don't want to pay like $20 for cursor and maybe like $200 for cloud code, I highly, highly recommend you using Kimi K2 because this model in terms of like agentic functionalities and writing code, this model performs much better than other models out there. And of course, it's far more cheaper than any other models out there. I'll actually make a few more in-depth videos with more use cases. So please just stay tuned and subscribe to this YouTube channel. And if you have any further questions, just leave your comments in comment sections and I see you next video. Bye bye.